Hi guys, welcome to the channel. When somebody asks you the question, how are you? How do you usually answer that question? Do you say, I'm fine thanks, and you? That's okay, but there are a lot more interesting ways to answer that question um, that are a lot more natural to native speakers. So in this video, I'm going to teach you a number of different ways to answer that question. If you do find the video helpful, then please hit like and subscribe if you'd like to see more. And don't forget to ring the notification bell so you don't miss anything. Let's get started. So we start with our question, how are you? And then we have our textbook answer. I'm fine, thanks. And you? Now we've got that out of the way, let's have a look at some more natural responses. Not too bad. How about you? So not too bad doesn't mean bad, it actually means good. Can't complain. You? All good thanks. And you? I'm alright. How about you? Never better. You know, surviving. So this is sort of like, life's not perfect, but I'm still alive. So on balance, pretty good. Could be worse. Now, uh, this actually means pretty good. Could be better. Mm, not good, not so good. But of course, when someone asks you, how are you? You never really want to answer negatively, um, I suppose, because it makes the other person uncomfortable. So it's, you know, we try to avoid that. But this is just a very gentle way of saying not perfect, not 100%. Um, and finally, how long have you got? Uh, this actually means not great. I have a lot of problems and it would take a long time to tell you about them all. So how long have you got? Have you got long enough? Of course, in reality, uh, if we say this, we don't really want to tell you all about our problems. It's just a, a light hearted way of saying that things are not very good right now. So kind of making a joke out of the situation. For more English tutorials, then take a look at my channel. And if you do like the content, then please remember to like and subscribe to see more. See you in the next video.